Getting set for race number eight from Red Shores in Charlottetown this afternoon as the Trotters line up behind the Metro Home Building Center starting gate. Vance Cameron, up to you for the race call. Scratch down to a field of five, so everyone here in this home hardware maritime breeder's stake gets a little piece of the purse, which is $13,700. Windermere got muscle, getting salty. Dusty Lane Kalani. Dynamic old tad. Irish Ray. Top of the stretch. Three roll hunters. Home hardware. Maritime breeder steak. Post time. The rough and trotting Windermere got muscle with the first call. Getting salty is second. Irish Ray, third one around the turn. Racing from fourth, Dusty Lane Kalani and the early trailer. Dynamic Tad as they arrive at the eighth. It's Windermere got muscle and the Blue Knight huge out in front early. Irish Ray keeps coming on the outside. Going to challenge and now take over the lead. Irish Ray and Campbell arrive at the lead as they get to the quarter mile. Second, Windermere got muscle. Now racing third is getting salty. Fourth is Dusty Lane Kalini and trailing the field. Fifth, Dynamic Tad 29 and four was the first quarter. Onward they go, passing on the three-eighths, now led by Irish Ray. Windermere got muscle is second, getting salty third, Dusty Lane Colenio fourth, and then the trailer, that is Dynamical Tad fifth. They're halfway home here in the eighth. Irish Ray clear by two, second Windermere got muscle, getting salty goes third, Dusty Lane Colenio goes fourth, and trailing fifth, that is Dynamical Tad, 59 and 2 for a half a mile. We're down to 3 eighths to go. Widening the lead is Irish Ray. Windermere got muscle alone second, back into third. Getting salty. Dusty Lane Kalini riding the rail fourth. Dynamical Tad on the outside fifth. Three quarters comes next. Irish Ray getting him there. Second and has closed in on the leader. Windermere got muscle. Three quarters up in 130. And one. They trot round the turn for the final time. Approaching the 7 8. Irish Ray by two open. Windermere got muscle is second. Getting salty third. Dusty Lane Kalini and Dynamical Tad. Down the stretch they come in the home hardware maritime breeders. Three-year-old trot. Irish Ray doubles up Mark Campbell. Windermere got muscle held second. Getting salty third. Two minutes. Four fifths. Okay, here's the slow-mo for race and number eight at Red Shores in Charlottetown, home hardware, Maritime Breeders, three-year-old trot. We'll see the trackside presentation in just a moment. The one of the two left a little bit off the wings, but Mark didn't wait long with Irish Ray out and around and to the front here. 29 and four, and pretty much bossed it the rest of the way here today. 59 and two for Irish Ray in complete control. They went to the backside. Jason closed in a little bit with Windermere got muscle, but Mark started to pull away again. 130 and one, and down the stretch he comes here now. Nice slow-mo here, and the Close up by Universal Media, Irish Ray, two minutes and four fifths. Make it 19 for 20 in career wins for Irish Ray. What an incredible career in the winner circle. Next.
Here comes Irish Ray into the eighth race winner's circle. Trotting bay gelding three, but muscle through it from the Garland Lobel Dam, a highly organized, owned by three Wiseman Stable of Kingston, bred by Blaine White of Bell River, trained by Brent Campbell. Mark Campbell picks up his second home hardware maritime breeders stake victory today for the double. Irish Ray trots home in two minutes and four fifths. Down at trackside, Peter Smith and Arnold Hagen from Home Hardware joining us with the Winner's Circle presentation.